All right, the last characteristic of living systems that we're going to talk about is this. And we have to make sure that we're talking about the biological definition of this. But here's the fact. Life evolves. Living systems evolve. They change over time. Now, this happens at the population level. Oh, this would be a phenomenal quiz question or exam question to look at these different um, characteristics of life and try and figure out, okay, what level of organization do we see this happening in? And evolution does not happen in individual critters. Evolution happens in changing populations. And we're actually going to spend an entire six lectures. The whole last chunk of the class is spent literally talking about the process of evolution and the results of evolution, the, the massive, oh, so cool biodiversity that we see on the planet as a result of the process of evolution. <sighs> That's it. Are you so excited to take this class? I know you are, because I am. This is awesome. So now you know the characteristics of life and how we are going to cover these characteristics throughout this entire course. And our next topic, our next uh, lecture, is going to be on the process of science, because science is how we even like figured any of this how we figured any of this stuff out in the first place. All right, see you later. Bye bye.